بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم رب زدني علما so that certification status you can always verify on your link so probably you can use this url slash go slash certification dot url now this url will help you to log into your cisco id now this is something you will be doing for the first time so if you are if you don't have a cisco id and if you are trying to log in for the first time you probably use this url to log into that and once you click on this basically you can log in uh probably you need to register and create an account cisco account and probably you can use this cisco account every time you log into the cisco website or uh, basically here i'm not doing that because i already have a cisco account so i'll be using the existing cisco id to log in and verify so probably you can use the same cisco login uh, or email address during the time of registering the exams okay so once i log in i, I can see some information here basically um you need you need to update you know this is my cisco id and probably you'll find all this information mailing address and everything like these are the certifications what i hold here you can see this is my cci clouding switching service provider and uh, security certification and this is going to retire probably in you know probably from when when i wrote my exams and probably when it is going to expire so all the certifications you can see they are valid even though i wrote this one on 2012 and this is in 2012 and this is in 2018 but you can see the certification status is uh, active till march 2020 if all the my 3 cci so which means i have uh, i it, before this march 2020 i have to write any of the uh, certification exam like i can write any of these core papers uh, core paper now based on the new syllabus or even if i write any other core and pa or pass my cci probably this will extend for the next two years so you can verify this status information you can also click on this certification progress options so this is like overview and similar information you'll you'll find here you can see okay so i got the screenshot here on my slide so basically this is the way you can check your certification status and other information also you can update like your mailing address or if you want the copy of your certificate you can use the other information 